Hey ladies, happy Sunday. Um, Ash here with our mannequin recap, our looks recap of, from this last week. Um, today I want to, I haven't done this in a little bit, but I was going to share a book that I just finished. Um, and so I'm going to share a little bit about it at the end, just a few things that I quick pulled out. Um, I have all the pages marked. You know, if you've been um, with us for a little bit, you know that's kind of one thing that I do. I mark all of my, I flip over my tabs and then um, go back to my favorite spots in the book. So with this one, I have a lot, lot of tabs marked. So I'm, okay, so with this book, I should tell you the name of it, right? Fingers in the Frosting, God's Hand on the Creation of Oh My Cupcakes. And if you didn't know, Oh My Cupcakes is in um, Sioux Falls. I believe they have two locations. Um, I need to get, I've seen their little, I've seen their kiosk in, in the mall, but I need to actually get to their location because people have said it's so awesome. Um, it's a really cool place to go. So, all right, I'm gonna show you these looks. And at the end, I have just a few quotes in here that I wanted to share with you. All right, let's take a look at our looks from this last week. The first one I'm going to start with is this um, mix of dressy with some jeans. Um, we have our black abstract blouse. Um, as of right now, we have an extra large and a 1X left in this one. I love this stretchy material. Super comfy, loose and flowy. Long enough you could do just a legging with it if you wanted to. Um, we added a pop of color in the necklace, but you could do a cardigan in any color. So red for the holidays. Um, burgundy, uh, green, whatever. Just throw any color with this top and it's gonna go with it. So I love that. Um, paired it with our cream longer knit cardigan, but it is still a little bit sheer, so it's not a super heavy one. And with this one, you can dress it up or down, throw it over a dress if you want to for the holidays. Um, we paired for the jeans, uh, we kept it a little bit um, casual with the jeans. You could just switch out the do like a black dress pant um, to make it more uh, work appropriate if you can't do a uh, dark wash denim like we did here. This is our high rise flare, just a couple sizes left in this. Um, but again, it does flare out at the bottom, so it is a little bit wider. And then it has that raw hem at the bottom. And then also kind of that raw hem all the way around the waistband here at the top. All right, off to the next look. So this guy comes um, the top comes in XL and 1X left. The bottoms of these jeans we have an extra large and a 3X left. Um, and then this cardigan is 1X, 2X, and 3X. For all these looks, you can click the link and um, check out what we have and see a closer up look. For the shoe today, I did our little black booty, our new um, block heel booty with the elastic ribbed band around the top super comfy and these guys you'll be able to wear a lot I think this holiday season all right on to our next look which is the dress um our new like hunter green dress I love it's a little shift dress with this bottom little ruffle on the um going along the bottom and then it even has so it has this wider ruffle and then there's just this little ruffle detail on the seam of that um and then pleating around the neckline which I love it's a three four sleeve it is lined so you're not gonna have to worry about putting anything underneath it you could do a if you wanted to um do black tights with this i think that would be really fun um a black blazer or a cardigan or even cream somebody threw the cream cardigan over it and that was great excuse me um the black booties with this dress look perfect i love this together you could do a flat or a little heel open toe heel with this dress as well of the colors and then for jewelry add just some really fun um chunky gold earrings with this all right on to the next one the next one we have um it's a similar top to our first top because it has that good it's that blouse material but it's super stretchy and comfy this guy does run a little bit oversized and loose fit um it has a baby doll shape to it with that ruffle along the bottom that goes all the way to the back it does have a short sleeve. Um, this pattern is kind of fun. Uh, I think it's mocha and black for the color, and it does have a little v-neck here. You could layer a turtleneck underneath it like we did here, which I love this look. Right now I am loving turtlenecks. I don't know what you guys, what your thoughts are on the turtlenecks or the mock necks, but they're my favorite and they have been for quite a while. <laughs> 
Um, but you could also layer uh, over it to cream, black, um, even a denim jacket if you did black bottoms would be good. For the bottoms, we did our faux, faux suede, excuse me, leggings. They are so stretchy and comfy. This material is really fun. I'm gonna sneak in so you can kind of see that. Um, I think even with these bottoms, you could grab a chunky sweater to pair with it and a booty or a flat to wear it to Christmas or Thanksgiving. And then you got your, your stretchy pants on for the holiday season, right? Um, Jenna layered a gold and faux pearl little necklace with this really cute and then for the shoes we did the gray just to kind of offset and give which I love because they're the, the same kind of dusty tones our little gray side slit booties these guys are easy to dress up too which is kind of what this outfit is it's a little dressier I love that all right on to the next one this one is a another layered look um with a cardigan and a simple waffle and our one of our best selling style of dress pants. Um, we'll jump into this look here. So new color black rust cream and kind of oatmeal cardigan. Love that. That one comes in small, medium, medium, large. It does have a little bit different sleeve on it. It's a wider sleeve um, and it is runs a little bit shorter. So kind of a kimono style sleeve. I love that really fun. You could pop um, a long sleeve out underneath that. A white button up underneath this would be fun too. I think you could even try maybe black under here as well. But this guy, it looks great. We, we've we also shown it with just even denim and a, a um, fall graphic tee too. So easy cardigan, um, perfect for the fall winter. We paired a purse with this one and it's one of our slim style messenger bags. I love the colors. All of these dusty colors look perfect together. So for the top, it is a waffle short sleeve, kind of a loose fit, relaxed little v-neck top. The top does run longer. So when you click the link, you can go um, check it out where it's not tucked in here. But just a lightweight layering um, t-shirt. We paired a little mocha tank underneath it to pop a little bit of color up there. And then these are the dress pants in this um, camel kind of mocha color. I love these guys. I think they'll be great with a black chunky sweater. This, um, you could do it for Christmas. This, this one kind of screams, um, and I would wear this for Christmas as well. It really does with all these colors look like a really dressy Thanksgiving look, um, but add a chunky uh, black or cream sweater for Christmas. And I think you'd be able to wear these for the holidays um, as well. So these pants come in small, to, small medium and large. Um, the small is going to be about a 5'7", medium is going to be a 7'9", and I would say the um, large is going to be like a 9'10", 10'12", maybe. They do have a really good elastic band. They've been running a little bit oversized, and then they do have a pocket in the front, which is always nice to have a pocket to toss your phone in or keys. All right, and then for jewelry, we did a new one of our new um, Link gold necklaces up here and you could do a booty with this but right now the snow hasn't flown yet so or, or dropped I should say um <laughs> flown <laughs> the so you could do a little booty as we get into the winter months but right now we are still rocking these um woven um little mules just slide on and go and they're so neutral they go with everything all right fast last few looks here and back this guy up so you guys can kind of see um, so our, our high rise skinny asymmetrical, um, hem jeans, they have zero distress. So they, you can wear them to work to the, on the weekend, wherever we paired it with a waffle, um, long sleeve top in this fun rust color. That's great for the holidays. This one comes in, um, XL one X and two X. It's loose fit. I love the little Henley style with the snaps in the front. We paired it with, we just have a few of this cream and black striped um, duster cardigan. And this guy also has pockets, but you can put the rust underneath this cardigan for now. And then as we get into the Christmas season, you're gonna do red, you can do hunter green, um, dress it up with a blouse underneath it, or you could put your favorite holiday graphic tee underneath it. So this, is, this cardigan is a neutral that you're gonna be able to wear with a lot of things. 
um, for sizes, I believe we have three X and possibly medium left in that cardigan, medium or large. Um, we did some little gold hoops with this guy, and then we added a fun little print on the shoe, which is our gray wedge cheetah slide on booty. These guys run small, so you wanna go up a full size. Um, they have that same elastic band as one of the other booties I was showing earlier. Um, just nice and easy, slide on and go. And this guy does have a little bit of a wedge here on it. So cute little shoe. I love it with the rust color, looks great. All right, our last and final look for the recap of this last week is the black um, fleck dress, long maxi. I love this for the fall winter. If you feel it, it's a little bit thicker than a regular, um, maybe summer blouse, blouse material dress. I think the lining they put underneath it just seems a little bit thicker than normal. Um, it does button all the way up or in the front. The buttons are functioning. So if you wanted to like layer it over something and leave it open, you could possibly try to do that. Um, the sleeve is three fourths sleeve with a little button on it. It has a good little V-neck. So if you wanted to layer something under there, you could. Um, we paired it with one of our new felt hats, which are so fun. Um, I grabbed, really you could put any color with this. I grabbed the green to kind of go with the colors that we have here in this collection today. And then for the booty, um, Jen had paired our cream block heel booty with it. Just slide on and go. I love this. And I think for if you wanted to add a layering piece, you could do a chunky cardigan with it if you wanted to, or even just a little um, denim, a denim jacket over this would kind of keep the boho um, vibes going with this little look. All right, now. All right, so like I said at the beginning, um, fingers in the frosting, God's hand in the creation of Oh My Cupcakes um, by Melissa M. Johnson. I got this from the She Speaks event a couple weekends ago, and I just finished it this last week. Such a good book. If you are um, thinking about stepping out and trying something new, or maybe you are already um, have your own business or doing your own little side hustle, um, this is just a good book um to read even for myself that i've been um, doing this store for six years and it was just a good reminder of a few things and to maybe go back and um remind myself of our mission and um just different things like my values go back to that just to make check check in and see um if you're following what you you had already like wrote when you first started okay so these are just kind of little random quotes I had marked in here. Um, the first one is, excuse me, lead with your whole messy and beautiful heart. And I really love that because I feel like it's so easy to um, look at other people or think that everything is like always perfect. I don't know, I know it sounds silly to think that things are so much smoother for other people. Um, and then sometimes I feel like when we're not perfect or we, I don't even want to say perfect, but like, I feel like I mess up a lot and mostly I'm okay with it. But I think this quote, reading it in, in somebody else's book, who's been in business since I think 2009, it said um, that even for her, she has this like massive uh, cupcake business that she's shipping cupcakes all over the U S and, um, even for her, things aren't, they're messy still. Uh, so it kind of makes you feel like, okay, I'm, I am a little, I'm not, I'm not a weirdo, I am normal. So, um, so I love that quote. I'm gonna read it one more time since I rambled on. Lead with your whole messy and beautiful heart. Love that. Okay. And let me know below if you've read this book or if you're gonna go grab it. The next thing, this one is, um, this one is more of a business one. Starting and owning a business will change you in ways you never imagined, both good and bad. Do it anyway, go for it anyway. And the reason why I put a little asterisk by this is because um, I have totally changed so much since I've started Boss and I know I still have lots of change to continue to do with myself personally, um, but 
it's definitely pushed me to do things that I never thought I would do. Um, and I've definitely gotten stronger. Um, I was more, as if you work here, if you've been around me, more of a weenie dog, <laughs> I would call myself. And I still got a little uh, weenie dog inside of me every once in a while, but I've definitely um, changed and gotten a little tougher and stronger um, as the store has grown and I've grown right along with it. So, all right, if you haven't read this book or heard about it, um, go snag it up. It's a good guy. It says it's $14.95 um, on the back of this book. All right, let me know what you think if you read it. Bye.